everyone, my name is Inkyo, and welcome back for another video. And today, we are going to be turning Animal Crossing New Horizons characters into cute boys. Because if you know anything about me, I love cute boys. And that's what we're going to do. Hold on a second. Something, something isn't right. Maybe, am I on the wrong channel? What is this? There we go. That's better. Like I was saying, today me and my friend Octo Inks took some of our favorite Animal Crossing characters and turned them into cute boys. We'll have our reactions to each other's designs at the end, so let's get right into it! Mari and I decided that one of the characters that we would do would both be the same, so both of us chose to do Blathers. There's very few characters who you could argue are as iconic as like Isabel or Tom Nook or KK Slider, but I think that Blathers is pretty high up there. He's been in the series since the very first game, well, the very first GameCube game. And so I think if you showed him to pretty much anybody, they would recognize him or at least recognize him as an Animal Crossing character. If I'm being honest, his model is a bit on the weird looking side. I think it's just because his eyes are so big. Personally, I think Celeste is a little bit cuter, uh, but I still think he's pretty cute. So I knew in order to emulate his big eyes, we had to give him big round glasses and we had to keep his bow tie. What a lot of people do is they'll give him like a suit jacket or a blazer, but I wanted to give him a sweater vest because I thought it was funny. This very well may be the most straightforward design I've ever done. You look at him and you go, oh yeah, that's, that's Blathers, that's the same guy. And so, you know, I wanted to really channel that nerd boyfriend energy, you know, Milo from Atlantis, Sunburst from My Little Pony. I think what I ended up was more librarian than museum curator, but that's fine, honestly. This is a very self-indulgent video for me because cute boys are kind of my weakness. So this was just a really fun and simple exercise in uh, turning a character into a Gajinka that I find attractive. Honestly, if you just change a few colors, it doesn't even look that much like Blathers, but that's not the biggest deal in the world to me. I still think he's cute. But because of that, I actually don't have a whole lot to say about his design. I think it was pretty straightforward. He's a guy with glasses, wearing a sweater, and holding a book. You could pick out pretty much any character design with those three assets and go, Oh yeah, that's Blathers from Animal Crossing. Honestly, I just really wanted an excuse to draw cute boys on my channel, since most of the redesigns I've done are of female characters, and so... You know, I wanted a chance to give it a shot at drawing a boy character. I think the only boy I've drawn on the channel is in my other Animal Crossing video with KK Slider. By the time I'm recording this voiceover, I've actually already seen Mari's designs. And I can assure you that his blathers is a lot more interesting than mine, so you should definitely go check out his video. But anyways, if you look like this... My Instagram and Discord are in the description. That's a joke, by the way. That's a joke. Unless... No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Anyways, here is my Blathers Gajinka. Next is Tom Nook. Tom, Tommy Boy, Thomas. I'd actually already given his design a try, but I didn't get further than the line art before giving up because he was not cooperating. He gave me so much trouble. I think it's because out of the special villagers, he actually has a really simple design. He doesn't have a mouth. He has very limited markings. So translating that onto a human design was going to be kind of difficult. I gave it my best shot though, I gave it my best shot. Probably the most distinct thing about him that can be translated into a human design is his sleepy kind of expression. So of course I had to keep that in my design. He also has a pretty distinct silhouette, so I didn't know what to do in order to replicate his ears. So the best solution that I found was just giving him curly hair and hope that the roundness of the curls in his hair balanced out with the roundness of his ears. I don't know if it worked. I think that Mari definitely did a better job of translating the characters' designs into human forms because mine kind of look like they're just 
guys who are like low-key cosplaying the Animal Crossing characters instead of just straight up human versions of the characters. But whether or not they resemble the characters they're based off of, I still really enjoyed getting the chance to just draw boys just because. I actually debated doing Tom's new leaf design instead because I think his little sweater outfit is really cute but then I thought all the greens might be a little too similar to Blathers and also that was just more difficult so I did end up going with his New Horizons button-up outfit which I also think is pretty cute. Probably the most difficult part was trying to replicate the pattern that's on his shirt. I really couldn't get it to look right but sometimes in life you just have to take that L. It's not that big of a deal. Anyways, here is Tom Nook. Wait, am I going first? <laughs> Wait, do you want to do you want to go first? I can It's up to you. You can go first. You go first. Okay, okay, okay. So, tell me tell me about your designs first before you send them. Oh. Okay. Don't send them. Away. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. Tell me okay. about them first. I designed Raymond, Blathers, and Flick, and I also added a little de uh, doodle of CJ, which is Flick's boyfriend. That's crazy! Oh my god! And, yeah, so I'm gonna do the big reveal right now. Blop. In the chat. <gasps> oh my god! <gasps> shut up. Shut up. Shut up! This <laughs> little pan! Oh my god! <gasps> Flick's tattoos. I'm gonna kill you. Dude. I'm gonna steal from Inko. I stole <laughs> from Inko. No! <laughs> These are my designs. They're so I love them. I was I had such fun time. Oh my god, his them. piercings that look like You're so smart. Your brain humongous. My brain is so textured. You're so cute! I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna hit you with my <laughs> I don't think I can put that on YouTube. Okay, my turn. I only got around to doing two because I was busy. So I so I only got around to doing uh, Blathers and Tom Nook. I was supposed to do Wilbur, but I guess he'll come in a later video. Um, so first is Blathers. I think I might have accidentally already sent him in in the chat once. <laughs> But that's him. He's, he's really basic. I love him! Oh my god. Dude. Dude, this is so scrumptious. So yummy. Oh my- He's so cute! Can I steal him? No! No! Please! No. I'm on my knees. Please! <laughs> I love yeah, him. Yeah, you can have him I if I can him. have- If I can have Tom Nook. I- I struggled a lot with him because I've done- I started a sketch of him before. Um, and it looked really bad, but, uh, oops. Here's- It did here's not the, look bad. Here's the final, here's- here's the him. <gasps> here's the him. <laughs> oh my god, he's so cute! Dude, this- this is literally what Tom Nook would look like IRL. He's this my, is crazy. He's my pookie. He's my pookie. Oh boy. my little pookie! Oh my, my pookie! God. Ah, he's so cute! I love me. him! You did so good. Ten yeah, out of ten. I love it. Kills you. Ten. Kills you with my car. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it was a little bit of a shorter one, but honestly, I think I would rather post uh, sillier videos like this in between my longer form videos, just in order to give y'all something to watch. Thank you so much to Mari Octo Inks for joining me in this challenge, and thank you so much to you for watching this video. And also, thank you to my $10 patrons, Elarista, Puntastic Artist, Full Fledgy, and Little Wolfine, as well as all of my other patrons. Y'all make this video possible, and I am so thankful for each and every one of you. With that being said, I'm Lucky Inkyo, and I will see you very soon.